Mobad Son's DNA. Lawyer Drugs Bombshell reveals that under the law, once a father acknowledges a child, no third party can contest it. Hmm. As the controversy over the paternity of Liam, the only child of late artist Ilerio Lua Aloba, also known as Mobad, continues as a Nigerian family lawyer. Onifade Olamide has claimed that once a man admits child as his, no third party has a right to question the child's paternity. The late singer's father, Joseph Aloba, had sought a DNA test to ascertain if Liam is his grandchild. His stance has provoked strong reactions with some supporting him and others criticizing him. While speaking on TVC recently, according to Nifadim, Mobad adopted Liam as his own throughout his life. Thus, no one can dispute against it now. She argued that because Mr. Loba is a third party in the dispute, the court cannot grant his request for DNA tests. Oh my God, this is too pathetic. Hmm. This is a bombshell to Mobad's dad because this is not what he wants to hear. According to her, in her words, and I quote, under the law, when a man and a woman are married, any child they have, there is something called presumption of legitimacy, meaning that the man is the biological father of the child. That is what the law says, except you can now prove it that the child is not the man's own. In this case, Mobad, during his lifetime, acknowledged the child as his own. Once a man acknowledges a child, no third party can come contest it. The third party, party here is the grandfather who is a busybody because the son said, this is my child until, until his RIP. If he goes against the court to demand for DNA test, the court will ask him to file an affidavit stating the reason why he wants a DNA test done. And he has to give very cogent reasons. Now, the person to dispute paternity must be in the proceedings. Now, the person to dispute paternity is what? RIP. Yes. So, guys, what this lawyer is saying is that when Mobad was alive, he never rejected his son. He never came up with this kind of thing, saying that this child isn't mine and all that. No. This child, Liam, Mobad has known him to be his child. So for the dad to come out, that is um, Mobad's dad, Mr. Loba, to now come out and start requesting for DNA tests is uncalled for because his son has accepted Liam as his son. So if there is anybody that wants to go against this, that wants to stand and say, this is not my child, it should be the father of Liam, which is Mobad, but now he is no more. So what Mr. Loba is doing is against the court. He's not going to get it. Oh my God, this is so, so surprising. Hmm, guys, what do you have to say about this? Because this man has been on this issue for a very long time. He said, if the um, DNA test isn't done, that they are not going to, you know, bury his child, the remains of his child, my people. So many people have reacted to this. Oladi Meiji David says, lawyers are part of this society problem. They will see white and call it black. Our society love darkness. What does it cost for the lady to accept DNA tests for her child in order to lay to rest all these allegations? If truly she is clean, DNA test is done everywhere, especially in advanced countries. Heaven will not fall if the child is not mobads. Mm, my people, what do you have to say about this? Do you agree with um Oladi Meji that it doesn't take anything? What if let's face the fact, what if her hands aren't clean and she doesn't want to be embarrassed. That's why she's still doing all these things. As well. That's why she's still dragging her legs. She doesn't want to do it. Hmm? Someone is saying, Olubben Rose says, Umi is desperately hiding something and is fundamental to the truth about Mubad's RIP. If she was not faithful to her husband, how are we sure she didn't act in concert with man she cheated on him with to cause his RIP? Hmm, this is serious. So, this is a serious allegation of Olubben Rolushola. Hmm? He went on to say, or oh, the man whom she cheated on Mobad with did not orchestrate Mobad's RIP. In unfaithful woman's life, this is how they are. 
is the surest source of RIP to Mobad. We may should to be stopped. Mm, guys, I don't want to talk too much because so many people have really, really reacted to this. They've said a lot of things. That why should the woman say that that's the lawyer? But looking at it, the lawyer is coming from the angle of the law. She is a lawyer. She cannot go contrary to the law. So from what she has said now, then Mr. Loba has to rest because what he is requesting for is not going to be made possible because the woman actually made a point. The law has a point. When Mobad was alive, he has never come out publicly to say that, you know, um, Liam wasn't his. So in his lyrics, he was passing some information, some messages. But we have to be careful what we say. Guys, what do you have to say about this? Let me hear your opinion in the comment section. Thank you all for always watching our videos and see you guys in my next video. Ciao, ciao.